create a new composition, size full HD, create a new layer. Add Stardust FX to the layer. Stardust create emitter and particle as default we don't need this right now. In Stardust new version we don't need emitter and particles to add a 3D object. Only we need the model node. Select file from the node select our 3D head model. Scale. Rotate in Y. And add two new lights so we can see your shadows and reflections. Add material node reduce color from particles to zero. I am trying to make it look like gold head. Add environment light to our scene, so we can have the real world lighting. Import HDR image and create a new HDR composition. Import HDR composition into our main comp. Assign HDR image in environment layer settings, now our scene has real world lighting. Ambient occlusion settings is also important we will use that later. Add roughness map to our model, roughness maps are black and white images black represents the roughness white represents the shinning. Create new composition for roughness map. Add curves adjust black and white. Reflection shows our model is metal or non-metal, increase reflection amount. Now we are going to create the ground level, add a new model node, select cylinder from primitive properties increase X and Y, create a new camera, add a new material nodes and connected with the model node, we don't need the color from particles so reduce the color from particles to zero, change diffuse color to red adjust the roughness map and check glass. Add background solid and gradient ramp to the background, change ramp shape to radial ramp. Now we will add our particles, add emitter and particle node adjust position to the right. We need our particles to emit in single direction so change it to directional. Adjust value orientation 180, reduce directions spam. We need models to emit from the particles create a new model node and connect with particle. Change particle color to random from gradient. Select one of the presets from color gradient. Add a material node. Before we are adding dynamics we need to save our project. Dynamic effects need cache files, so it is necessary to save the file. Turn on simulation from physics settings. Add physics note and connect it with particle. In physical node there are two important settings dynamics and kinematics. Dynamics are objects like ball which are bounce from other objects. Kinematics are objects like wall which are always static. Increase speed in a emitter. Create another physical node and connect our head model and ground plane. Change the type to kinematics we don't need the ground plane model to move. Adjust particle size, increase size random. That's it guys thank you.